Checking out local Christmas light displays is a happy tradition for many of us during the holidays. When we see the Christmas displays, we rarely think about the people behind that magic. We just see that finished result. So a local man, he knows that something as small as Christmas lights can bring a whole lot of joy to a community. So new this morning, reporter Kaylin McLaughlin has more information on the man behind the magic. Good morning, Kaylin. Good morning, Alicia. Today, you'll get to know a community member that has dedicated his entire life to giving back. Leo Phillips was born and raised right here in Mandan. For many years, he's been the man behind the magic of making sure Mandan has its share of holiday spirit. Leo Phillips is a local man who's dedicated his entire life to give back to the Mandan community. He grew up with nine siblings and has watched the city of Mandan grow and change. He recalls helping his father play neighborhood Santa as a child. My dad kind of instilled it in us when we were young. We would drive around and drop stuff off at people's houses. And then we'd run and hide and we'd watch them and when they come out, just to see the smiles. Leo is active in many community organizations and has volunteered with Mandan Progress Organization for about 10 years. The one thing I don't see is the participation in a lot of the community anymore. Getting volunteers is very hard, you know, getting people just to give a little bit. The last year has been rough for Leo. Back in August, he had a massive heart attack that resulted in his heart stopping, but he barely missed a beat. Shortly after, he caught COVID and then laryngitis, but he knew there was still work to be done. They, they did revive me, so God was not done with me yet. So they revived me, and within three days after the surgery, I was ready to go again, and they couldn't believe it. Phillips has found joy in putting up the Christmas light display downtown Mandan for the past five Christmases. This year was no different. With the help of some local homeless volunteers, Leo spent over 100 hours decorating downtown Mandan. To see their smiles now is my payback for what God has given me. Leo is not only a father and a grandfather, he's also a neighborhood hero to so many families that get to enjoy the lights. There are about 66 displays to see. The lights are located on West Main Street in downtown Mandan and are typically on about 5 p.m. Just amazing work that he has done and just all of the recruits he has helping him. It's just amazing. Right. So I'm glad he got that help because yeah. 100 hours is a oh, lot of work. <laughs> and especially after going through what he has. So Definitely. Kudos to him. He's a trooper. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Thank you very much, Kayla.